Hey everybody, this is Joby, and I'm back with the Booger Man. Right now what we're going to do is uh, power level enchanting. Now this is the hardest one, I think, of all of them. A lot of people ask me, can I do like a quick power level for everything? And no, you cannot. I mean, I did make a video about how to use the intricate gear. Get it from your other characters if you have a lot of crafters. Deconstruct on each station or with the uh, rag picker, which I think is a great accessory. I understand a lot of people, you're not going to buy it from the crown store, and that's fine. You can just use the table sets. You have to deconstruct stuff to do clothing, woodworking, jewelry, blacksmithing. That's the only way. So you can level them up real fast if you're out running around doing stuff. You're doing dungeons. Just deconstruct all the gear. Of course, if you're with your teammates and they want some gear, just uh, just give it to them. Be a nice person. For enchanting, this is the hardest one. And the reason it's hard is because it goes very slowly if you just use trash glyphs. When I say tra trash glyphs, what I'm talking about are those glyphs that if you go to a public dungeon, you get a lot of them. Uh, you kill ads and you get all kinds of glyphs. All right, so what we're going to do, what I've done is I've gone on PUA Deeps and I made a bunch of purple glyphs with Rakudas, okay? Uh, it's a problem when you don't have bank space to get them to the other character, but if you don't have a crafter that's already leveled up to make the purple glyphs, what you can do is go and buy a bunch of Rakudas and um, give them to a friend or a guildie and have them make them for you. So we're going to go here to the enchanting table. I'm going to go down to extraction and you can see uh, I have 84 truly superb glyphs of poison and if I show you this I can show you how I make them. Uh, I just used uh, Rapora which is the highest. I have 1.3 thousand so I went ahead and used that and then I went to the K something let me see what it is Kuoko had a bunch of those so I used that and then I just went to Rakuda. You want to use Kudas? Okay go ahead I'm not the boss of you but it's a waste of money I'm telling you because the difference between crushing these up and crushing these up is just minimal. It's like diminishing returns. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to extraction. I'm level 5 right now and let's see what happens. I don't know if it's going to make it all the way. I'm not going to do any more after this. But uh, we will see. It's heading up there. Come on. I don't know. At least I'll be higher and I'll be able to uh, put some points in it. You know and uh, I'm going to make it. Um, I kind of doubt it though. He's 84. Yeah, 36. So probably, um, I would say like another 25 or 30 would do it. So around 120 glyphs altogether to get you from 5 all the way to 50. The reason, you know, to me the reason that I want to do that kind of stuff is to get better reward. Hireling, if we look in skills, if we look in enchanting, you know, I can... I can put uh, points here, and I'm going to go ahead and do that. I'll only be like level 6 or something. Oh, 7. 8. Okay, so the next one is at 40. 4 more, and then the after it's 37, it'll be 50. Or when I'm 30, level 37, which I could get pretty easily. But, uh, well, level 40, and then from 40, uh, once I put the point in, uh, to level 50 will be, you know, 10 levels. And you have to have that before you can put the point all the way up. So aspect improvement, I don't really do that. But I'm going to go ahead and hit the hireling. And that's going to give me three hirelings. Now when I'm level 10, I'll get kudas and stuff from those hirelings that come in the mail. Very good. Um, you know, I go through 14 characters and I just do my writs. And then after I do my writs, I leave the bags from the hireling in the mail and I also leave the crafting rewards and I just log out then when I come on the mo in the morning I go through all of them it also gives me a 12 hour cycle so I'll get mail on every single character and it's a massive amount of stuff that you get especially if everybody's all leveled up these little guys they won't get as much money they only get about 700 so uh, you definitely want to get your character leveled and over 50 unless you want low level uh, materials, which I understand, you know, some people want that. They sell it and can make a lot of money in a trade guild from selling, you know, void cloth and lots of stuff. I mean, that stuff's like 20000 a stack for void cloth. You know, it's almost unavailable. You have to look around in all the guild traders. So that's like a little side hustle you can do. Uh, you have a low-level character. You go out and you collect all that stuff with your surveys. Because, like, look at this guy. I think, um, 
Well, I might, I might be lying. I might not have any surveys on this guy, but we can see from the stuff that I've, uh, I've gathered. Check it out. Nah, I don't. I'm wrong. But on my other characters that I haven't really been crafting with this guy, though, I think 14 characters is plenty. You know, maybe too much. When you craft on your other characters, you get lots of surveys. Whatever level you are, that's what you get when you go pick them up. You know, um, there's so many ways to make gold in this game. You just don't have enough time. There's more ways than there is time. So that's it. And so I got up to level, uh, on my enchanting, level 36 from level 5. You just have to do it again. And it doesn't really matter. You don't have to have any experience. Uh, you do need skill points, though, but I just use the armory station and switch them out. Then switch the gear back whenever I'm going to go do stuff and fight. Inventory space becomes a problem. Bank space becomes a problem. I've bought all these boxes, and you can put uh, some of the glyphs in the boxes. You have maybe buy more inventory space, buy more bank space. It gets real expensive, but once you're set up, everything's done, and you don't have to worry about it. You know, if you're not interested in doing this, I mean, this is really the only way is to crush up... Uh, glyphs if you don't want to do this and you don't want to spend the money or you just don't have the money i understand go to a public dungeon run around in there with your friends and uh kill ads and then just you get the glyphs off their bodies and crush them up but it is much slower it takes so long to uh level up enchanting what i just showed you is the fastest way if you use kudas it's only a little bit faster and they're so expensive that it's just not worth it i get rakudas all the time and uh, you can even go to the guild trader and buy them. You know, if you buy a hundred Rakutas or a stack of Rakutas, I can't. I don't even know how much it's going to cost. It might be a lot. So I, I just don't know because I've been level ten on my main for quite some time. Well, that's really about it for the power leveling. Um, that's the way I do it. I'm sure that there's just entire tribes of people that play this game and they just have like such a better way to do it. I mean, my way is probably the worst way to do it and you know, people are going to tell me in the, you know, YouTube comments about how I don't know what I'm talking about and I'm terrible. And I just say, I totally agree with you. Okay. So you don't even need to say it. I already know. All right. That's that. So please give me a like and a subscribe if you enjoy the content and uh, leave a comment in the comment section and uh, tell me what you think. Uh, to, if you have a better way, let me know. I'd love to hear it. You know, do you like to do this crafting and power leveling and stuff like that? Is that a is that helpful to you? I just want to know. Join me on Discord, the most chill Discord server on the planet. There's a link in the description. And if you're not doing anything at 15 p.m. Eastern time, follow me on Twitch. Upper Echelon Mediocrity is the name of the channel. Have a great time in there. Right now, it's kind of spotty. Uh, today, I didn't even play with anybody. I went to Taipei yesterday to pick up my daughter and, uh, you know, got back. I was like five hours driving so uh, today I just feel real uh, kind of loose so I just did a bunch of personal stuff high high aisle is coming so that's like day after tomorrow and when that drops gonna be lots of crazy stuff going on everybody's asking me you're gonna get open soul you're gonna go get that new set you're gonna go get <laughs> so you know I'm gonna be real busy just like doing a lot of stuff with the guildies and uh, I don't know when zeal of Zenithar is coming but it is coming pretty soon if you're on Xbox, North American server, you can join my guild. And my guild's name is Upper Echelon Mediocrity, just like the YouTube channel. And uh, right now we have 42 people online, 487 total members, one member pending. It's a good time. We're not in the guild finder, so you need to send me a message on Xbox. My name is Coyote, C-H-A-O-T-U-I, and I'll get you in as soon as time permits and whatnot. All right, so until that time, let's get paid. Thank you.